What's up everybody, it's yours truly, Fit City, and we've got some information based off what the exclusive move is going to be for Eevee for this upcoming community day, a two-day community day. And there's a lot of confusion going around, and people just aren't quite understanding what is really going to happen with the exclusive move and some of the Gen 4 hints that people are throwing around on Twitter. So I'm going to clear all that up, and we're going to go over everything. So if you haven't heard, Last Resort is the newest exclusive move. It's apparently a two-bar charge move if you follow Pokemon Go on Twitter. Uh, shows two-bar charge move. It's going to probably be a very powerful two-bar charge move. Uh, Last Resort was a pretty strong move in uh, Gen 4 when it was released. A little bit uh, on that in a minute. But uh, two-bar charge move, it's a normal move. Now, uh, we won't read this here, and there's a reason why. But let's go ahead and look at the results from uh, the Squirtle Community Day. It seems like it was forever ago, because actually it was. Uh, it was a little over a month ago. So, it looks like Team Instinct still dominating North America. Team Mystic was dominating almost the entire world. And then Valor always taking it over in Australia and uh, New Zealand in that area. Would like to see this a little more mixed out, but we'll have to see what happens. Now, as always, we go over the Community Day pictures. Absolutely amazing. That one in the middle there is the Community in Chile. That is an amazing community. Trainer Tips is wanting to go down there. I wish I could. Uh, looks like a lot of fun, but there's a lot of good uh, pictures in here. Oh, <laughs> that's awesome. That gym. I've seen that on Twitter. I should have posted mine on Twitter, hashtag community day, but I don't think I did. Uh, it was something similar to one of these. Yeah, it was similar to this. Uh, I think I posted this on Twitter. I can't remember. But uh, mine was a lot better than this one. But I guess that's a missed opportunity. Community is still awesome as always. So let's get back to the confusion part though. What's going on? People are thinking that the, the exclusive move is only going to be for Eevee. That's not true because we had to actually go to the Pokemon.com website to find out what's really going on. So let's go ahead and read here. If you aren't already hyped, there's more to be excited about during this back-to-back -back community day. Eevee caught during the event windows will know the last resort, a move it cannot normally learn. And its evolutions aren't about to be left out of the fun. Any Eevee that evolves between the start of Saturday's community day until the end of Sunday's will know last resort in its evolved form. So what that means is you can catch a ton of Eevee or shiny Eevees. And if you evolve them anytime between the start of community day on Saturday, anytime in between then to the end of community day on Sunday, that evolution form where it be Flareon, Jolteon, Vaporeon, you walk your EV 10 kilometers to get an Espeon during the day or an Umbreon at night. In between those hours, 24 hours basically, you will have last resort as an exclusive move for those EV evolutions. So there was a lot of confusion around that because this post didn't go out first. Uh, the Pokemon Go Community Day page I just showed you, that's what was posted and there was confusion there. But now it's cleared up, you will get last resort for any of the evolutions that you choose to do. My personal opinion is don't really worry about your evolutions having last resort. We're going to have to see how strong of a move it is. But you're probably just going to want the best movesets for your shiny evolutions for their typing. Um, the last resort, again, if it's a good move, I don't know. It might be neat to have a shiny Umbreon with last resort. Which brings me to another tip for you guys for community day. Catch as many shiny EVs as you can because for Jolteon, Vaporeon, or Flareon, it's going to be a random reroll. It really is. That's what stinks. You can only guarantee Umbreon or Espeon right now in the game for uh, the shiny forms. But Vaporeon, Jolteon, or Flareon, there's nothing in the APK, there's nothing in the code that says that we're going to be able to use any kind of tricks to guarantee our evolutions. So again, we'll have to see, but I don't want anyone to get their hopes up. It looks like it's going to be random. Now, the last thing to talk about is there's hype all over Twitter of people talking about Last Resort is a damage dealing normal type move introduced in Gen 4. And we had that Gen 4 leak that was fake, and we had the Gen 4 confirmation by Niantic with the uh, Year 2 poster. We saw Turtwig, uh, Chimchar, I don't know if I'm saying that right, and uh, Piplup. And so that's basically guaranteeing Gen 4 is coming eventually. Uh, but people are saying, oh my gosh, 
Last resort. Exclusive move. Gen 4. Gen 4 is around the corner. Not so fast. If we go to this website here, and I'll link it down in the description down below if you want to check it out. These are moves that came from Gen 4. Aqua Tail. We've had that in the game forever. Aqua Jet. We've had that game forever. Avalanche. Brave Bird. Bug Bite. Bug Buzz. Bullet Punch. Charge Beam. Close Combat. Cross Poison is actually even in the game. Uh, Dark Pulse. Like, look at <laughs> Draco Meteor. That was an exclusive move. Uh, but that was an old one. Um, should I go any farther? Energy Ball is actually in the game. Fire Fang. Flash Cannon. Focus Blast. So, don't believe everything you see on social media because there are already a ton of Gen 4 moves in the game. And that happened a very long time ago. So, just thought I'd throw that out there so you guys could manage your hype responsibly. Hopefully again, last resort, we get some uh, data on that, how strong it is. I'll be doing a video, it'll be in the APK. Uh, Antonio should be mining that soon from the Go Hub anyway. So, that's with the boy Fit City. Leave a comment down below. What evolution are you most excited for to get shiny? Do you really want all of them? Because I think it's going to be a struggle to get all of them, even in two days, honestly. Um, I'm not going to be able to partake in the first day. I'm going to have my girlfriend play for me. I have a golf tournament to win. So, more details on that and how that works out Sunday. Um, but, yeah, leave a comment down below. I want to know which one you guys are most excited for. Smash the like button. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. Be a part of the Fit City fam. I'm signing off. See you guys in the next Pokemon Go video.